Hello, hello everybody and welcome back to The Banished. Will you join us here in Summitsburg, our slightly cramped town? With 15 people at the courthouse and 146 at the church, giving us a total of 164 citizens. Cool. Very cool. How are we doing for houses? I have 66 homes and 56 families, so we have 10 empty houses. How is our houses coming along anyway? A lot of them have been built already. I still got 6 of them built by the looks of it. I'm okay with that. This would be episode 21, so this is by far now my, well currently, at the time of recording, this is my longest series to date, which I am particularly happy about. But, I feel the end is near for it, unfortunately, because it's, uh, it's an older version of Colonial Charter I'm using, and uh, kind of running out of things to really do, in my opinion. I know that I could make some refined resources and the likes, but I don't know, I just kind of kind of want that there. don't know why. I'm going to put that there. I know I don't need it just now, but I want to need it. Make tin to me, I suppose. But, um... I think what we do is we banish a couple of our people in a few episodes and see if we can take them with us. We'll have to see about what the court says on the matter. But annoyingly, this is still being built. How do I need the fancy? Furniture. And I know there is no hardwood anywhere around. Although I did plant hardwood, it looks like these trees do look different around here, as you can see. So, what I will do is tell my people to cut down a whole heap of trees. That didn't make the slightest bit of difference. Have you produced any hard? You have. Cool. Well, just you carry on. How are these trees coming along? Slowly. You're on a 5% yield, and this one's on a 2% yield. That's a bit worrying. But, we are now producing more food than we're consuming, which is fantastic news. The frame rate is really low because of just the... I suppose it's because everything's so compact, to be honest. Why is that in materials? It should be in iron. I did that again. That's supposed to be a material stockpile. our fancy furniture guy doing anything? I suppose I could move the map down here. It would make more sense in my opinion. So coming over here. How is our mine coming along? Oh and you found a gemstone. Congratulations. So in that case I want you to make some silverware. Muster up all the silver that we have. Is there any in here? Wouldn't surprise me. Oh there isn't. That's Uh, I want you to 
me silver. Go ahead and do that for me, please. And you're making a steady supply of rope for whatever reason. Town is coming together. More of a city now, to be honest. If this was out in the middle of nowhere, it would probably be classed as a city. But we'll get. It. Well, there's our stockpile done. I'm actually really tempted to do a Adam and Eve series. I think that could be quite challenging. Managed by people very, very very tediously though, but it could be interesting. So we want it 10 by 2, just like that. Is that material system? It is, that's a bonus. So there should be some people complaining, there you go, we don't have any silver. You'll be going in. I don't know you've got some silver ore in. You make quite a bit of copper, but it's some silver I now want you to make. And where is my guy? fancy furniture? I want you to make fancy homewares, please. Let's run out all that. Tools. Do I not have something making tools? I'm sure I've got a blacksmith making tools. My country blacksmith. I don't think I ever did look at the houses of my next. They're annoyingly different, but they are quite nice. Yeah, you're supposed to be making tools. Why are you not? Just not to keep up with the demand. That's fine. I'll put another blacksmith in there with you. So, food's on the rise. Are you making anything yet? You have some hardwood in. Obviously, you don't have materials, but it looks like there's some. Oh, it's tin. Never mind. Candles. Nothing in. Have you produced anything yet? Just normal furniture. All of our houses that seem to have been completed. Not overly happy with this fight. Yeah, there's nothing I can actually do about it now. Um, Well, what can you do? We have a trader. What have you got for us? Nothing I'd like. We can now see how the trader reacts with this new bit of land that miraculously appeared. It's just you go through that forge. It's fine. We now have somebody without tools, so let me just... There's no excuse to not have tools. You need to be a very skilled yachtsman. Rower to get around this area now. Um, close enough, I suppose. He kind of does the best he can. It's understandable. What is these? What are the builders even doing? Do a 
apologise around about the background noise. As I've mentioned in many of my previous videos, I have the world's most annoying neighbours. Every day seems to be a challenge for them to make as much noise as humanly possible. But it's fine. I do plan on moving very soon. Hopefully to a quieter area. I'm worried that the food's gone down quite a bit. It may take a couple of years to build it back up to a reasonable level, but we'll just see. Someone has died. A farmer. That I don't like. I don't like that. How's our graveyards coming on? 13 in that one. And 6 in that one. So this one's nearly full, actually. Look nearly full, but it apparently is. You can only take three more graves. One, two, three, four, five, six. So I presume seven, eight, nine. I think I can't put a path through here. You are walking through it anyway, which is just downright disrespectful. Nomads, I will have you. Thank you. I will allow 20 nomads. Undoubtedly, some of them will end up in here. Loads of them. So, have a look at our overview. We've got 72 homes and 63 families, so get out of there and go get yourself some houses. There's no excuse. How many people does that give us in total? 192 people. Oh, we're now going to struggle for food. Say nothing about that. No, no. Eliza, dirty man. What is this? An outbreak of typhus has occurred. Oh dear. I think it's time that we hire somebody in our hospital. and uh, heal yourself immediately. Don't be spreading that anywhere. Uh, 49 years old. Don't be gathering food. Go to the hospital. I would be reasonably healthy and happy. Good to know, but now go to the hospital. Transmitting the plague to anyone. Typhus. Never heard of it. It's a thing. It was about to happen at some point when you put a population of this many people, some of them will get sick. What do we need for this building here again? Wine, fruit, and glassware, honey, bone meal, and cloth. Veg oil, ginger, and glass. I don't have any of those things. Well, that's unfortunate. Oh, I've got 12 workers. So I want them to come along and clear all of that. That'll give us a big supply of wood. But get to it. Chop chop. Could be done with another little bridge though. Not really where I wanted it, but I reckon with it. Yeah, I can live with that. Two bridges across here so far, which are probably getting quite a bit of use. And 
me see. Now there's two people with it. Give it to a monk? Really? That's unfortunate. <laughs> I can't believe they, they gave it to a monk. I've oh, got the one monk as well. Um, here, go ahead and make your aim. How are you? Come oh, along. You're not really just as much as I'd like. This area is not being chopped down either. See how we get on there. Hopefully, the plague doesn't spread too much. Tempted to hire another doctor. I can't hire another doctor. That's really unfortunate. Fancy home first. Well, apparently it's mid two. Well, okay. You've run out of hardware, apparently. That's okay by me. There is a lot of lumber there. Ah, hell of a lot of lumber there. You know, I'll knock this down to one. Sack two people. Need to slow down with the lumber. saying that you don't have reeds. Fair enough, I guess. Well, with the two people I sacked from the lumber yard, but I have a third person with me. I'm going to put two more people in here. Shoot double production. Any luck. Is this built yet? No. Nope. Uh, that's there it is. Chop chop with that. Don't know where the uh, fancy homebrews have gone. Got them sitting right there. Uh, building supplies. Ten homebrews. More of them over here. Pardon me. Homebrews here. Another building supplies. Okay. How much are you producing? Not enough. That's the long and short of it. Not enough. He's not produced anything. Yet. Just totally useful. Okay, so I need more of that. More of that. And more of this. So let's have a look at this and see how we're doing for reduction of food. We are using more than we've produced. Again. Can we live here? There's still a heap of people here. We have a 14 year old doctor, that's maybe why the disease is spreading. Oh, it's in that he has cured one person. You're visiting the doctor. Nine-year-old with the plague. You're visiting the doctor. Too. Cool. Both of our people are visiting the doctor. Our doctor will probably catch the death now. Is this area over here being cleared yet? I need it to be as soon as possible.
chop chop. No pun intended. Now, we need this to be cleared because I need to put farmland in the lights in here. How much you come up to basically that end bit there. So if I put another one of these, which I know I'm kind of reusing them quite a bit. If I put another one of these roughly here, be another supply of food. Could have put another set of houses along here too, and then fields behind it. But I need all of this wooden stuff out of the way first. I don't want to just, you know, I don't want to build that. That, that looks horrible. It would take forever. And the builders are so lazy. Have you built that water tower yet? Water tower is built. No, it's not. It's nearly built. It's not got its lid on yet. Or its ladder. Still got all this area here that we need to work in. Now I can foresee me cutting a lot of this path out because this just looks kind of a bit daft to be fair. How are you getting on now that you have double the workers? You're barely doing anything still. Oh, thought I seen something go there. Well, I want to... What is that doing? I want to increase priority in this area, please. Like... Roads. There we go, good. We have a builder. Three out of four builders working on this. Our people are so slow, look at them. No hurry at all, are they? So hopefully this gets built this year and we can hire somebody in there to be collecting some coins for us of sorts. I'm not going to try and pronounce that horrible name. Here's our ducks getting. But I have five. And five people are okay. Mostly children, but plainly enough. We, we need our children. Our children are useful, just keep them away from the uh, Eliza here. Turn out that might be his child, but it does look a bit fun to be wrong side. A 57 year old with a 12 year old. I'm going to pass it, no judgement there. This game works in mysterious ways. Ask people to flatten the terrain here. I'm going to ask them to do it rather than asking me to do it because if I do it, we'll lose resources. But if I get them to do it, we'll move the resources and then do it. Oh, there are people loitering around this, so. This one should be built. Quite a nice view of an iron mine that the governor's office is going to have. Oh, that's uh, the way to build anything. Yeah, I, I used to be a builder, and I have to say this is how I built things too. I go a building site if you like. Let's start with the roof. We don't need to build the walls or anything like that. Let's just throw the roof fully completed on top, on some posts, and build everything else around it. Hang the door before the walls are in and things like that. That's, you know, the way things are done. But that's okay. I do enjoy this game quite a lot. I know I give it quite a lot of hate, but it is a very good game. Very addictive. I have logged over 200 hours of playtime on this game alone, which is ridiculous considering that I play over 15 games on a regular basis. 
know why the people are walking so slow. That uh, might be why. Yeah, I'm moaning about how slow they are. Yeah, that's better. So let's hire a governor. You, you need to go about and collect taxes from the people. That's actually a really nice model. They're a bit insane, really. But quite nice old sim. About time it got built as well, actually. It's been a building site for like ever. What's the last two jobs that you just need to do? I expect this is one. The bridge has been built. Don't know what the last two jobs are, but you get on with them. We are slowly getting there. We're in early autumn. The plague is spreading badly. Do I have to hire someone for the water tower? I'm gonna turn it off. Don't need them to collect water, there's a river here. I just thought it looked nice. So, the other thing I would like to do is fix our roads around here. I know it's a country area, or it's got the impression of a country area because of all the farmland. But, I don't know, I just, it, it annoys me that it's right in the middle of town like this. I need it to go to there. This one needs to go all the way down here. Like so, I have no idea what the neighbors are doing. Sounds like they're doing some serious construction work. Wouldn't surprise me to be honest. It's a communal building I stay in. They're probably deciding to remodel the lobby. Because they like to do things like that when I'm recording. Um, I would like to say that they're quiet most of the time, but that's not true. They're the loudest people in the world. They repeatedly wake me up in the middle of the night, shouting at their televisions. Yeah, I don't want that there. I'll come back and fix that bit. So, we're in autumn. We have food, we have everything we, we need. This area is starting to clear off. Which means I can immediately jump in with a field that is uh, 14 by 14. And I want another one right next to this, exactly the same. Something like that. Get them done immediately. Do it now. That'll get some more food coming in anyway. That coupled with our fisherman's dock that's way up here somewhere. Don't know if it's even built yet. No, it's not even been started. No, no. Builders are going to be occupied with all these paths for a little while. But, plague is finally cured, which is nice to see. I do apologise about that slight little jump cut there. I was interrupted by my doorbell going, which did lead me to look outside of my front door, which is nice to see that it appears that the neighbours across the lobby are moving out. I can't say I will miss them. And apparently, what do you, what's wrong with you? Sick of what? Your child? I'm visiting the doctor, go. Don't. 
don't be sick. That's my advice to you. Be healthy. speed up time again. Get things done a little bit quicker. This is starting to be cleared. Nice to see this is almost cleared. That is almost cleared too. Hopefully by next year I'll have both these fields going and this fisherman's dock. Not sure about the fisherman's dock but there's one field. Produce me some carrots. I'm gonna I'm gonna just leave this just now, right? So what is my food limit? Why is it so low? I'd like it to be something ridiculous like ninety thousand. Should never be only mod food. There we go, we have 14 farmers in total now. And we have a heap of fields. There's two, four, six fields we have, all full of carrots. Our citizens are probably going to turn orange. Still haven't got a name for them. Some some tins. Burn victims, I don't know. I have no idea what to call them. Burnians. I do that. Then I can put some decorative items along the front here of some sort. Throw something in here anyway. The area does look a bit bland, unfortunately so. But this would be a nice spot over here for Reasonably big barn, actually. What is this? Uh, all so materials such as glass, ores, clay, bricks, boots, plus homewares, and materials. You know what? I actually wouldn't mind this. Let me just build Oh, I think I'll put the log one in first. Somewhere like that. And then the stone one. And then the big one. Iron one. And then the materials one. That could look quite smart. Hopefully these are all on the same level. They seem to be. That was a good guess. It was a good guess indeed. It was an educated guess, but it was a guess all the same. Something like that. We got all them built, that's going to take a little while to do all that, but we'll hire someone in each one, so it's five workers straight away on that. Let's have a look at our census data. So, food. It's close, but we are producing slightly more than we've used. It's really, really close, but eh. There are 201 citizens, 72 homes, 69 families. Is anyone living in our boarding house? Still a couple of families in there. Quite, uh, quite a few families, actually. Fair enough. It's unfortunate. Nothing I can do with that, really. This fisherman's dock is ready to build. I can attempt it to just straight line across here now. Something like that 
followed by that. Oh, I wish it would actually click on the things I click on to. Might look a little bit weird, but I like it. The river is getting some terraforming done to it. But it does mean that I can go ahead and stick a road in from here all the way along the front here. And I can then join it up with there. Oh, one of our little shed things is being built. Most of them are ready. What's this one we need? Building supplies. So there should be one king or something. There's our governor's office doing. Silver peffling, peffing, peppinining, coin. Silver coin with a llama on it by the looks of it. There are 20 of them. No complaints. So what I'm actually going to do is just tell you to take in some of the coins. There we go. Taking a hundred of them in total. How much are they worth? One. Really? They have a value of one. Pointless. That's like, like really high value. But we're in late winter. Let's see if we can get this building done before the end of the year. Or at least the end of the episode. That would be nice. Almost there. This is our wood storage area. This is going to take over from our stockpile I expect. There we go, wood storage, we don't hire anyone in there. Oh, we have a trader. What do you have for us? Wheat seeds. Ooh. Ooh. I don't think I have much in the way of value, to be honest. That's annoying. Uh, I feel like at least one of them. Lettuce seems to be nice. Two people just died back to back. Lilums. Uh, that's unfortunate. Oh dear. Well, what can you do? But we're in early spring. And we're slowly getting there. This building's gonna look weird because I built it in winter, so the roofs are not gonna match, but what can you do? There's no wooden at all. Looks like quite a small building, but I have wood in it anyway. And this is the. Apparently a wood storage as well. Just double check. Wood. Stone. Iron. Tear. Uh, okay. Yeah. Take that one down because I built the wrong thing there. But anyway, it's the end of this episode, unfortunately. Hopefully you have enjoyed this episode. If you have, then please don't forget to leave a like on this video. Leave me a comment as to what we should call our summits burn people. And don't forget to go 
would click on that subscribe button. It does help a lot and we greatly appreciate it. Thank you for watching and I will see you again next time. Bye for now.